私はブライアンです。私は UTM の学生です。どうぞよろしくお願いします。Hey everyone, hope everybody is doing fine. After two months of MCO and CMCO, I have decided to start learning Japanese.、Uh, since I've not done anything from the start of the lockdown. So,、uh, there are other reasons to, to learning Japanese also, other than getting rid of my beauty conscious. So, I learned Japanese because I really like their culture, like anime,、uh, J pop, and Japan in general. Yeah, so the best way to learn their culture is through、uh, their language first.、Lah. Okay, so. And I really have a lot of time in my hands since everything is online and I really have too much time on hand. So I want to do something to learn something new. <coughs> One more thing is that I might want to go to、uh, Japan to either further my studies or to backpack around Japan. Yeah. But the biggest reason that is driving me to do this is because I want to. And I am willing to do it. Yeah. So I found Yoko Sensei as my teacher, recommended by one of my friends in Japan.、Uh, Yoko Sensei、uh, is very good. And so far, I've attended two of her classes and I've learned a lot. I mean, really a lot from her. Yeah. To be honest, Japanese is like a mixture of Chinese. And English, yeah. So, both of these together you can get Japanese. As I have learned Chinese and English throughout my study years, Japanese to me is fairly easy, at least easier than Chinese, yeah. So, however, the biggest challenge here is in learning a new language is the alphabets, the basic building blocks. In this case, is Hiragana and katakana.、Uh, kanji is not that、uh, is not that basic because kanji mostly is made from the pronunciation of hiragana. Throughout these ten days of learning, it is very frustrating for me to read. Okay, because I need to take the time, quite a long time actually, to think and process the words one by one because I'm. I'm like a baby learning a new language, yeah. Not a baby, but a grown man, yeah. So it takes time for me to digest and to think and to process all the information that is coming in, yeah. So I really need to put in a lot, a lot of effort learning this language. But、uh, I want to keep a positive mindset that, oh, it's easy, so that I can、uh, get the knowledge or the information in faster. Yeah, so there is no shortcut to language, lah. Okay, there is really no shortcut to language because language needs a lot of practice. Yeah, so there is only a few few ways to master language. You need to read a lot, speak a lot, and also write a lot. For my how how I study. Uh, this for these ten days, ah,、uh, consistency is key lah. On a daily basis, I put around two to three hours in studying. So after I wake up, I will do one hour around one hour of、uh, studying. Okay, probably writing some stuff or reading up some stuff, and and then I will spend around one to two hours depending on the day. Okay, one to two hours to study the the grammar and all the writing vocab. So and so forth, lah. Okay, 
and I would rest uh, after five straight days of studying. And this is consistency lah, that I believe which can help me uh, learn this language more efficiently. Because since it's a new language to me, so I will read all the words that I write down very loud lah, okay? in order to get the, the, the pronunciation and the writing uh, inside my head. Okay, uh, I learn like this uh, because it's better for me and it will more efficient. Uh. Plus, I do watch anime from time to time, I mean, I, quite often. Uh, okay, and I pick up some of the words they say uh, along the way. Uh, like learn some new vocabs. Yeah, so uh, I, I used, uh, I found hiragana and katakana worksheets online. Uh, it's on the screen, you can see. And I'll link it down below. Yeah, not sponsored. Yeah, so uh, you can go to this website to actually take the katakana and hiragana work- worksheet because there is no need to spend money to actually buy workbooks on hiragana and katakana. It's not worth it. Yeah, not worth it. Ah, I used uh, Mina no Nihongo as the textbook and exercises. Yeah. So. I'll do one round of writing all, yeah, writing all, and after that, this is the writing part. A reading part, I will do a quiz online later. So there are two things to test uh, my proficiency at this point. So hiragana first. Ah, 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 i, u, e, o, ka, ki, ku, ke, ko, sa. Shi zu su se so so ta shi zu zu te to na ni nu ne no na ni nu ne no ha ki u u he o ma mi mu me mo ya yu yo ma mi mo ya yu yo ga ri ru he o wa o i so hiragana done. Hopefully there's no wrong. And now for katakana. I've done the katakana part. Yeah, so I've, I've memorized all of it. Hopefully it's uh, correct. Let me check. Okay, it's actually quite good. So uh, now I will go to the reading part. Yeah, so I will show our share screen. Chi. U. E. O. Ha. Hi. Ki. Mo. Nu. E. Ne. Me. I. Uh, Eh, ha, sorry, ha, ka, eh, ta, nu, nu, fu, se, no, uh, nu, su, su, sorry, su, su, uh, ka, ka, no, stop, ka, uh, mu, uh, na, he, ru, Re ro, sorry, ro, ya, m, yo, mo, ho ho, sorry, ho. Then this one is uh, wa, you, so, mi, ma, ho, ku, ri, ko, ko, ke, ka, to, ni, uh, ka. 
This one is K. Yeah. So I've done this one. Around I did it two time. Okay. I'll check the one later. So now for katakana. Katakana is Yeah. Now go. Yes. Yes. I think it's too early to celebrate because uh, this is just a very small part of uh, the tip of the iceberg. Yeah. So this is just the basic to get me through uh, all the reading notes and the exercises to actually let me know what I'm actually reading. Yeah. Hopefully, I didn't go into the like uh, shi, shi, cha, all, all those. I think it's just a combination. So I won't, I, I didn't go into it. And yeah, basically, I, I already uh, can read. Okay, but very slowly, I can read Japanese. Yay! Now I really need to put in a lot, a lot of effort to making this uh, Japanese thing, uh, making me master Japanese. Lah. I'm going to set myself a small goal. Yeah, I'm going to set myself to make a video in Japanese only. Yeah, where I only speak Japanese for 10 minutes or so after one or two months yeah one or two months around the range if you have any tips resources websites channels advice that you can give me yeah do drop it down in the comments section below yeah it will really help out my learning japanese journey lah. okay thanks for watching remember to like and share this video and hit the subscribe button. Arigato gozaimasu. Mata raishu.